Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a haul video and it is the first kind of haul video like this that I have done. Let me preface this with I recently started a thrift shop on Poshmark. It is called Shop Back Around. I will leave a link to the thrift shop in the description below. But in any case, to have a thrift shop, you need to have inventory. And while I had a few pieces in mine and my husband's closets that, you know, could go up on there. Um, I wanted to have inventory that people really were looking for and sustainable and secondhand fashion is just so practical right now and I know that it's what a lot of people are turning to especially during this pandemic because it is cheaper more sustainable and just overall a good um, selection of things that you can find at a thrift store so that is why I go and I source for pieces so when I say that I source for pieces that means I'm going to the thrift store I'm going through almost every piece of clothing in the thrift store which sometimes can take a really long time and I am individually picking out what I think people will be looking for or what they would like to be able to list on my Poshmark. So the items that you will find on my little thrift shop are specially curated by me. They are pieces that I think are trendy, that are in season or, you know, have come back around. There are some vintage pieces, some uh, pieces that are no longer made, but are still kind of in style because we all know that things that are in style one year may come back around in 10 years and be in style again. So these are all pieces that I think are trendy that people are looking for or that would want. So I wanna share with you some of the pieces that I have today. These are all available on the Poshmark site. So like I said, I will leave a link to that in the description below. I also wanna share a few pieces with you that have already sold. So first I'm gonna share the pieces with you that have sold and I will leave little pictures here of the listings on the Poshmark so that you can see what they look like. So the first piece that sold was this yellow plaid jumpsuit from Urban Outfitters. I think that this is so in trend right now or so trendy right now because I feel like the 60s, 70s kind of vibe, like retro vibe is coming back. So this was so trendy. This was my first piece that sold and it went almost immediately. I absolutely loved this jumpsuit. Honestly, if it didn't sell, I probably would have kept it for myself, but it can be styled so many different ways and I think it's so cute. Next are these pair of wide leg trousers from Zara. They were a really thick material and they were really nice for either work or just lounging around. They were like a material that the waistband was stretchy. There wasn't any like buttons or zippers or ties or anything. Um, so they were a stretchy pant, but they were heavy and they looked like they would be good for work as well. And they kind of remind me of gaucho pants from back in the day. But I know this wide leg trend is definitely in right now. So that is why I picked up this piece as well. And it sold just the other day actually and then there's a sweater from Madewell I absolutely love this sweater honestly if it didn't sell I probably would have kept it for myself but it is this black and white windowpane sweater with a mock neck this is actually last I checked it was still available on their site but obviously I sold it for a much markdown price and I absolutely love this it was a nice material it was good for the weather that we have right now kind of like the transition from winter to spring so I thought it was super cute I ended up getting it for like six dollars I think and I sold it for 30 so that was actually a really good deal for both me and the buyer considering that on their site it was going for like $80. So aside from these pieces I actually also sold I think like a tank top, a couple graphic tees, and um, a dress shirt of my husband's but I'm not going to share those just because they were pieces that my first sourcing trip I kind of didn't educate myself or really know what I was doing. So I was just picking up pieces. And a lot of the graphic tees that I picked up, I am looking back now and I'm like, all right, they probably weren't the best picks, but they did sell. So I'm happy about that. I do have a few left that I will show you just because I have them on hand here. But since that first trip, I have learned a lot about um, some brands to be on the lookout for, brands that people are searching for, pieces that are in trend. But in any case, that first sourcing trip wasn't, you know, the best. Best, but I'm happy that these pieces did sell so there's that and now I'm going to share with you the pieces that I still have in inventory so I will show them to you on here and if you are interested in any of them of course you can head to the Poshmark shop with the link in my bio or in the description. So the first piece is this Tommy Hilfiger crop top. If you can see this here, I know it's kind of hard to see, but it's super cute. I really like that it is like the color block with the um, white and the red, and it just feels very on brand for Tommy Hilfiger. I really like that it is crop because crop is in right now. So this is super cute. And I think 
Oh, honestly, I'm surprised that this is still in stock. I did have a lot of likes on Poshmark, but I ended up getting this, I think for maybe $8 and I currently have it listed for 15. So if you're interested in this, I know that Tommy Hilfiger, I looked up some comps and this was actually going for over $40. So if you're interested, this is a size extra small and I think it's so cute, especially for like the Gen Z um, audience right now. I know that Tommy Hilfiger is definitely in. You can pair this with a pair of like mom jeans or boyfriend jeans, I think it would be so cute for spring. So next is another like kind of graphic tee crop top and it is this top from obey this top actually gives me like total 90s vibes i'm literally picturing this with a pair of baggy jeans and like a choker necklace and like kind of like a grunge look but i actually really like this and i know obey is a brand that is really sought after it actually can be quite expensive but i have this listed right now for 15 dollars. it is a size small and i think it is really cute like minimalistic i love these sleeves they're kind of like three quarter length sleeves i think this would be really cute if you are into the 90s look like I said I have it listed for $15 I believe it was originally going for like over 50 so I feel like $15 is a good deal and I think that I got this for $5 $6 something like that so next is a piece that I'm so surprised that is still available and it is this jumpsuit from moon river it's so cute it's going to be hard to show you in this camera but it is available on the website it has these wide legs it is a really cute checkered pattern and it's actually new with tags the tags are still attached to this here you can see them here it is a size small and I believe Moon River is actually a brand that is available at Urban Outfitters maybe. I don't remember. Or Anthro maybe? Nordstrom? It is available at one of the higher end retailers. I do remember seeing that. But in any case, this is such a cute jumpsuit. And I believe it was going for over $100, but I have it listed right now for $50. Um, I love that these uh, straps are adjustable. You can tie them and then you have the button detail in the front here. I think it is so cute for spring, especially Easter. I think when the weather warms up, you can use this for, you know, just the tank or you put a short sleeve shirt underneath in any case i think it's so cute and i'm so surprised it's still available to be honest with you so next is another graphic tee and this one is from the brand next level and it is of taylor swift so taylor swift as we all know is a huge pop star right now this is actually a really neat t-shirt that's why i picked it up this was from my first sourcing trip so granted i didn't really know what i was doing but i figured if taylor swift is on it then it's got to have a chance i'm surprised it's still in inventory actually because it's got a ton of likes on Poshmark. But anyway, this is a size extra large. If you aren't an extra large size, but you love this t-shirt, I still think that this would look cute as like a t-shirt dress. So I actually think that this is really neat. Um, I had never heard of the brand Next Level before. Yeah, so I think I read that the shirt was available for like 30 maybe, but I do have it listed for 10. So next is another new with tags item and it is this sweatshirt dress that says Sunday Forever. It is from the brand Daisy Street. Could you see that there? Yeah. So it is, it's actually really nice. It's a really thick material. Um, I believe this was available on Nasty Gal, but I'm not entirely sure. I had never heard of the brand Daisy Street until I found this, but it is a brand, I believe from the UK. And I think this is actually really neat. Um, I know sweatshirt dresses are kind of in right now. And especially with the graphic uh, on it, this is embroidered. It's actually really nice. It is a size UK eight and US small. And I have it available right now. Let me see what I have it available for. For $15. So that's actually a pretty good deal for a dress. So next is this cardigan from Zara. It's actually a really thick material. It's really nice. I know that Zara is a brand that tends to go quite fast on Poshmark. Um, so this is Zara uh, Knit. It is a knit sweater. It's quite heavy. It's got like a drop shoulder. And then these sleeves are kind of like wide sleeves they're not um, cinched at the bottom but i think that this would be really nice for work and it will definitely keep you warm if you are working in a cold office um, i like the gray it's it's nice and neutral so it'll go with just about anything it is a size us medium and i have it listed for 40 dollars. i did read that this was going for close to 100 dollars, so i think 40 dollars is a pretty good deal with any of these pieces if you make me an offer that is you know 
reasonable. I usually accept it. So be sure to check that out. So next is this uh, sweater from Moth, which is an anthropology brand. I actually really like this color. Um, I like that the sleeves are kind of like the wide sleeves. I think that this is more of a fall sweater than a spring sweater just because of the color. But nonetheless, you could definitely wear it for spring because it is kind of like, like the crochet kind of material. Like you can see through it. So you will have to wear something underneath of it or like a nice bralette or you know tank top whatever your preference is but in any case i think this is really cute and it's definitely a trend i think you could wear it with like a pair of and gen z forgive me skinny jeans and sandals i think it would be super cute um it is a size small and i have it listed at 50 dollars um anthropology uh, pieces usually go for upwards of a hundred dollars and it is a very nice material it's quite heavy actually so next is another sweater from moth and it is this pom-pom sweater which i think is so cute um it is missing a few pom-poms here one there there and there like in this middle row here but you can't really tell when you look at it from afar it just looks like it's supposed to be like that it is a size medium it went at anthropology for 148 dollars but i have it listed for 40 i think this is so cute and i do think that this will be nice in the spring just because it's nice and colorful and just super adorable like i said size medium super cute so next is this new with tags graphic tee from nasty gal it says let it go and let yourself grow i thought this was super cute here is the graphic up close i really can't see around my uh camera here or around the shirt my camera so sorry if this is out of view but like i said new with tags it is a size extra extra large but i think it would also look cute as a t-shirt dress if uh this isn't your size but I have it listed right now for $10. I think it is so, so cute. I really like the graphic on it. And I know that graphic tees are in right now. And especially like this kind of like aesthetic, I feel like it's super in right now. So next is this blazer from Josephine Charles. Um, I think it is so cute. The tweed is just adorable. Tweed is in. Um, I think it is so classy. I really like it. It's got the button detail on the sleeve and then the distressed leather collar. I think this is really super cute. It is a size 12. Um, I think this would be nice for year round at the office. It was running for, I think, $150, but I have it listed at 75 right now. But if you make me a good offer, I will accept. It has the buttons on the front. I just think it is so nice and classy. I think that uh, pieces like this are timeless and that it doesn't matter your age or your occupation that I think you look really cute in it. So next is a Nordstrom brand and it is Chelsea 28. And this sweater is a nice V-neck, like, brown tannish uh sweater it is a size extra small it looks it doesn't have tags but it looks like it's never been worn it is more of like a thin material so it's not a very thick sweater um it has the cinched sleeve but i think it is a nice material for the spring if you are working in an office or if your home office because i know a lot of people are working from home still is a bit chilly this is nice i think that you could wear this with leggings or jeans or dress pants i feel like this is a very versatile sweater and chelsea 28 is a big brand at nordstrom and it goes for quite a lot of money this was actually 69 dollars at nordstrom but i have it listed right now for 40 but again if you make me a good offer i will accept so next we have this super cute uh, velvet wrap top from Madewell. I absolutely love this color. Um, it's kind of like a pinkish brown. I don't really know how to explain it, but it is a wrap top. It is so hard. When I was taking pictures of this, it was so hard to like really get the point across of what it should look like, but it has the strings here and you tie them across you know like a wrap it's hard to do but um it does wrap across the front here when you tie it um it would look really cute with a pair of jeans or a pair of leggings i think that this is such a neat style right now and made well is a very good brand um it was in store i think for almost 100 maybe i could be wrong about that i couldn't find the exact comp but i do have it listed right now for 40. um i think this looks almost brand new it doesn't have the tags attached but like there's no flaws on it or anything i think it is such a nice top and the velvet is so soft so next we have this really nice jumpsuit from anthropology it is this 
really nice print. I love this like Aztec print. It is so cute. It's black and white. Um, it's got a button back as well as a zipper back so you can adjust. The front has buttons that you can unclasp or button up. It's up to you. And the it's got a tie around the waist and the um, the ankles are cinched so they do stretch but they are a nice like kind of like a jogger bottom. It is a nice material. It's not cotton. Um, I don't know how to really explain this material, but it's a bit stretchy. I think it's really nice. It was valued at $158 on uh, Anthropology site, but I have it listed for 70. It is a size US 10 or UK 14. I think this is so pretty for the uh, spring and summer and even fall and I just I really like this actually I wish it was in my size so next is another new with tags item and this is a polo sweater from the brand something navy which is sold at Nordstrom um something navy I believe is a blogger brand and those are always very sought after because those pieces don't always they're usually limited they don't always last more than one season but anyway so this is a super cute sweater it's got the collar up top it's got like a scoop neck and the sleeves are kind of these like skinny sleeves and it's got like the ribbed uh wrists i think it's super cute it is a size extra extra small so it is a very particular size but i think it's really cute it's not too thick it is soft and like i said it is new with tags here and this originally i think i read that it was going for let me see here I think I read that it was going for 150. I have it listed at 50. So this next item, I honestly just, I couldn't not get them because they, I've never seen something like this, but they just seem so incredible and I wish they were my size. But it is these joggers from, I believe, if the brand is Flygo, but I'm not sure where that is sold. I think Amazon maybe, but in any case, I couldn't pass these up and you're probably like, why? They're just a pair of joggers. But because the entire inside is Sherpa, they are new with tags, like I said, they are a size extra large and they are so thick and heavy. Like they are incredible. The entire, when I say the entire thing is lined with Sherpa, I mean like the entire length of the pants is lined with Sherpa. Um, they are adjustable. They have the drawstring here. I think they just are going to keep you warm like nothing else can and they have pockets. So that's always a plus. I have them listed right now for $30, but I will take the best offer and I just think that these are so amazing. So next we have another new tags item and let me clasp this together so that they're easier to show. It is this pair of plaid like dress trousers from Chris F believe it was a collaboration with a blogger or an influencer. I honestly am not sure who this is, but it's Chris Sell and JOA, which is the brand Just One Answer. And they are so, so nice. I believe they were sold at Nordstrom. They are such a nice material. I love this window pane like print. The bottom has these gold button detail and the buttons do come undone if you want more of like a flare. Um, they are a straight leg, so they're not skinny. They're not, you know, flare, they're straight leg and they like I said are new with tags here um, comes with an extra button in case you need it so I looked up what they were going for and on um, Nordstrom they were going for 135 but I have them listed for 60 they are a size medium and they are just so stinking cute I'm obsessed with them I think they would look so cute with any kind of dress top um, I did see some matching blazers out there. I couldn't find them in the thrift store, unfortunately, but search around Poshmark and you might even be able to find a matching blazer to this. I think these are so cute. And another new with tags item. I got really lucky this last trip because I got so many new with tag items. And this is from the brand Meadow Rue, which is an anthropology brand. And it is this super cute, like, buckled skirt it is like a felt material so it's really soft it's got in the back here it has these like cut out detailings it's not a pocket or anything but it zippers in the back like I said you've got the buckles in the front 
It is new with the tag. Here is the anthropology tag. And it is a size US 2 and UK 6. I just think it is so stinking cute. I'm obsessed with this. I think this is perfect for the warmer weather coming up. Um, you could also use this or wear this in the winter as well with some black tights, but I just think it's so cute. And it kind of has like that cottage core uh, kind of vibe, which I know is super in right now, especially on like TikTok. So I think this is so cute. It was going for 128. I have it listed for 50, super cute. And these last two items are jeans. So first we have this pair of jeans from AG and Anthropology. I don't remember what the AG stands for. Adri Adriano Goldschmied. I think I'm pronouncing that right. They are a size 25 regular. Um, they are skinny jean. They are a dark wash. They have a nice little detail on the back here. Um, and then the button has the gold me. Here they are. AG Anthropology. But these are a nice like, basic jean that literally you can match with just about anything. I think they are so versatile and don't even pay attention to what the Gen Zers are saying. I think that skinny jeans are still in. Don't hate the skinny jeans because they go with so much and they make so many outfits look so nice. So these actually retail for almost $200 at $198. I have them listed for $80, but I will take the best offer. And this last pair, I was actually really shocked to find, but they are a pair of jeans from True Religion, which is a very well-known uh, denim brand. And they are the Billy Super T, uh, straight leg jean. They are a light wash. They have the red stitching. Um, they are a size 27. I think they're so nice. Here is the back. You got the button pockets, the red stitching there. Um, they're really, really nice. Um, straight leg and they actually retailed for, I read, $2.98. So I have them listed for $80. Um, I just... I was really shocked to find a pair of true religion jeans if I'm being completely honest. And they're a straight leg, so they're not the skinny jean. So if you are like into the what Gen Z says trends, they're not skinny, they're straight. So those are all the pieces that I currently have available on my Poshmark shop. Like I said, the shop is called Shop Back Around. You can follow on Instagram at Shop Back Around, or you can check out the Poshmark closet at Shop Back Around, and I will leave links to both of those things in the description down below. Um, I would love to see if you have any good thrift finds. I love watching videos of people's thrift shop hauls, so if you have one, please let me know. I want to watch it. And if you you have any advice on selling on Poshmark or anything let me know because I'm new to this this is kind of like a new venture for me but I'm really excited about it just because I'm obsessed with clothing and fashion and all that stuff and if you've been watching my channel for a while or follow along with my blog Unbreakable Bliss you know these things so I'm really excited for this new venture and I hope that you like some of the pieces that you saw today like I said I'm not opposed to bartering with people on Poshmark so if you want to make an offer on any of these things please do and if you like today's video make sure you hit the red button down below subscribe to my channel and click the bell next to it to be notified whenever i post and make sure you follow me on social media at brie cutter and until next time see you guys